Hi, this is just a quick video. Um, basically, um, a review of this um, walking stick stroke monopod. Um, basically, it is mainly a walking stick that does have a camera attachment on the top. Um, now, for me personally, I have a medical condition, which means I have to walk with a walking stick um, for any distance. And I love my photography. So, you know, um, it's absolutely great for putting it on. So let's just get the box up. And this is um, one that I've got. This one's by a company called Needis. Um, there's Camlink and there's a few other manufacturers, but they're all exactly the same, you know, telescopic ones. So let's just get it out of the box. That's, whoa, this is not the best done opening I have ever done, but there we go. So inside you get the stick itself. Then you have um, a strap, the attachment. So if you're getting um, on ground where it's getting stuck in the ground, that can actually do that. And then you get the end on the bottom. Now, like I say, because I've got this medical condition, which I'll put a link up here somewhere, um, me talking about it, a spinal condition and everything else. Now, because I use it as an everyday walking stick, the, the thinner part of this really doesn't suit me. Um, so what I do is I get larger fennels or ends, whatever you want to call them, and basically um, put those over the top. But I have to trim this down, as you can see, um, what I'm doing now, you know, so yeah, but the actual stick itself, it is not just a monopod because a normal monopod, you've just got the straight up bit there. So you then got the camera, which is fine if you want to hold it from the side. But like me, because I use it as a walking stick, I like to hold it from that way. Now, this bit here, well, you get a silly compass on the top. Trust me, they're an absolute waste of time. They never work. They never do anything. Things so they can just go away like that. But the top here, yeah, that then unscrews and then you can rotate it. Like, let's show you a bit better, like that. So you can get then, you know, portrait as well as landscape and then just twist it back and then that locks into position, um, which is absolutely great. Most of the time um, it, it's vertical. Um, and I mean, to attach the camera, because it does have your standard uh, quarter, tripod mount let's get rid of my camera here and all you do is just screw that on like that which then as you can see the camera you know is perfectly on there now yes if you're holding it dependent on the camera dependent on your, your tripod mount you may need like a little washer in there so it's fully tight facing forward because if i have it facing forward with this camera it is a little bit loose and i have that on there so you know you just tighten that up and then that's that now as far as the extendability you've got three sections you've got one that way and let me just put it that way so you can see a little bit better and then another one there i mean the total height let me just quickly check that i should have checked that beforehand is 141.5 centimeters and the lowest is 70.5 now um, and it does have um, anti-shock. I don't know if you can read it on there, um, but basically it's then got springs in there. So when you're putting it down, it just helps out instead of something being solid. Now, I've always used this um, as a main stick and everything else. I mean, I've been using a stick now for the past seven years. And I mean, I have to admit, these are absolutely great for me. I do get through them, I get through say one a year per car because I've got the two vehicles, so one's in each car. Um, only because it is used as an everyday stick, that means going shopping, you know, just going out and about, just anything, as well as going on walks and when I'm away in the camper, uh, which if you're new to the channel or anything like that, you know, I've got a little camper van that I converted, um, which I go away in and, you know, I love my photography and now I've started doing the YouTube videos as well. So again, um, I'll put a link up there. And if you can, it's gonna really help me channel, is just give a sub or give a like or anything like that because it does really help me. And it gives me the incentive to carry on well anyway back to this so basically like i say your camera is on there and you know just walking with it is absolutely perfect i then have a manfrotto uh, quick release plate and um, plate that goes onto this camera so it makes it a lot easier for me to unclip and then put it on my tripod especially doing these videos out and about and everything else the um, weight that it can take is actually three kilos um, but unfortunately i've had problems where it has broke this top bit as broken as actually come away 
um, but I don't know if that's because I've used like quick release plates or anything else but again do remember I use this as an everyday stick it is not just for walking and everything else so you should be fine with that anyway I mean like I say this has been a godsend um, to me um, because of wanting to get out and do the photography and everything else it's absolutely been brilliant I mean now personally I don't have the camera as much on it unless we're just going out for a day out because when I'm out on my trips I mainly have it then on my um, tripod so it's easy to get off to take the shots of me walking past and, and everything else but I do have to wrangle around it. Now I will put links in the description. On a side note as well, I do have like a little bag attached to the side. I think they're for old motorcycles, they have phones or whatever, and I just wrap it around and because then I can keep, you know, spare batches in there, my tablets that I need and everything else. Um, great little stick and everything else. So um, hope you've enjoyed this quick, well, not quick review, but you know what I mean. So yeah, thank you for watching and um, please check out my other stuff. Okay, cheers. Bye.